Greetings, I'm Craig Smizer. Austin is full of neat little places that are worth taking the time to explore. We're going to look at three of them on this episode of Discover Austin. We're at the corner of Eastside Drive and Sunset Lane at the Larry Monroe Forever Bridge. The bridge has been covered with ceramic tiles to create a mosaic artwork in tribute to Larry Monroe. Larry was a popular radio broadcaster in Austin for more than 30 years and was a tireless promoter of not just Austin musicians, but those from across Texas. After he died in 2014, the music community looked for a way to memorialize him. The result is the Larry Monroe Forever Bridge, with custom tiles made by more than 100 volunteers and paid for by more than 300 donors. For those who are fans of Larry, there are plenty of great references to him and his radio shows that you'll recognize. For those who didn't know Larry, just by reading the tiles, you'll get a good starter education on who he was. The bridge is in a nice setting near Little Stacy Park, with a creek running underneath and walking paths nearby. Welcome to Fairy Alley. This incredible magic little spot is located adjacent to 1507 Treadwell Street, which is just off Lamar and not too far from Zilker Park. In an effort to clean up the overgrown alley, artist Suvi Ika created the colorful murals and tiny fairy houses, though if you ask her, she'll simply tell you that one day the fairies showed up and created it on their own. There are many small details to check out with the houses and other miniature displays that are set up. The ground of the alley is painted like a koi pond. It's great to view at any time of year, but there are extra decorations at Halloween, Christmas, and Easter. We're now at Sparky Park, which is located at 3701 Groom Street. It's a pocket park, which means that it's rather small and it's just smack dab in the middle of the neighborhood. It used to be an electrical substation, but has been converted. You'll see nods to its electric heritage all around the park, including, of course, the name. After a cell tower was constructed on the site, the city asked a local artist to create something that would block the equipment and make the park more inviting. The result is the grotto wall. Neighbors pitched in by contributing items that were set into the wall, such as marbles, shells, broken antique dishes, and more. One of the things I really like is that people will leave little artifacts, notes, and assorted objects in the wall tucked into the nooks and crevices. It's fun to see what people have left, and you can certainly bring your own thing to leave as well. The building that housed the electrical equipment from the 1930s has been converted into a community room. There are a few benches around, and it's a great place to have a picnic. There are lots of great little places across Austin, and it's fun to get off the beaten path and check out some of the things that are not so well known. So I invite you to head on out to see the Larry Monroe Forever Bridge, Fairy Alley, or Sparky Park. I'm Craig Smizer. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Discover Austin. <laughs>